All right, so I'm on a little mini mission today. Uh, sent out to pick up some furniture by myself. Giant china cabinet. Giant desk. So let's head up this way. Oh, by the way, I'm getting this desk. I don't think I found it. I'm buying this desk for the shop. It was $26. By myself. Um, so I'm here with the truck and trailer. I'm gonna go in and grab the china cabinet. Now I've already been in and I've got a few pieces I saw and I was asked to bring the camera along and just in case I came across anything, film it. <sighs> okay, fine, you win. I got a small little pile going and I'm seeing some more stuff. So we'll take a look. We'll pick out a few more things and uh, then I'll kill myself loading a china cabinet by myself. Did I mention I'm by myself? <laughs> I'll see you guys in a bit. All right, so I'm gonna take a peek in the back room real quick. Um, I kind of grazed through here. The dogs look kind of interesting for 10 bucks. It's two bucks a piece on them. Hmm, nobody's bit on them yet, so I wouldn't feel awful grabbing them. Let's see, let's see what they're... I like the Scotty with the bug. Well, oh, he's got a ladybug on his nose. That's cool. Yeah, England. Well, that's a better piece. It's not made in Japan or China. Yeah, we're gonna grab those for three bucks, or 10 bucks rather. Yeah, why not? These guys are great, and I don't see any. These guys are marked Japan. Well, he is. Let's see if these, yeah, these guys are marked too. That's cool. This guy looks like he's chalkware. I like him. All right, so we're gonna grab those for 10 bucks. They're always enjoyable. What else we got here? Got some stamps. Let's see. Oh, that's a nice patriotic collection. There's a lot of great history involved in stamps too. I mean, if, if not for anything else, you can learn a lot from them. They put a lot of subject matters on there. Um, all kinds of stuff. Oh, cool. Yeah, see, like, here's a World War II collection. Victory collection. He's got first day covers. What else we got here? The victory at sea. Ooh ships yeah so like like i say there's all kinds of subject matter and you can learn about the monitor the merrimack or manila bay and remember the main all kinds of cool stuff presidential covers space covers they've got bids on this stuff too so that's good that shows an interest and that's that's a good thing this thing's just geez that was loaded that's a lot of work for me though so cool I like the cash register that one's killer what five hundred dollars for that that's actually really cool you usually see them a lot bigger you don't usually see them in a the smaller size like that that's actually kind of cool but alas I need my hands now I need to grab dogs and put them up at the front all right I'll see you in a bit I got a nice little pile going here. This thing is beautiful. I think this one's only 10. I'm gonna grab that one. All this stuff is down pretty low in price now because we're past the, the end dates on it and stuff. So, um, some more check. These are German. This one's really cool. I love the lines on that. Made in Czechoslovakia. Great stuff. So, but this is what I'm here for. This monster. I have to take that, load that up, and take that home. Actually, I actually have to go get a desk after this. So let's go shop a little bit. Take a break. See you in a bit. All right, so I've picked out these pieces too. This one's cool. It's got a different mark on the bottom. Oh, let's see if we can get that to focus. Focus. Come on. Yeah, it's not going to focus. Oh, there it goes. Hand painted Moravian. That one's really pretty. I like that one. Oh, 
It's called a little lid. We get the little teapot, creamer, sugar, and a little pedestal. That one's pretty cool. So we'll grab those, put those up front. All right, let's see you in a bit. We still got more to look at. Hmm, Barrister Bookcase. I like it. Look at all the glasses intact, too. Yeah. I don't know. Thinking about it. It's only $91. Mmm, it's actually not a bad price. It's not as sturdy as I, as the other one I got. Uh, I don't know. I'll have to think about it. I like it though. I added more to the pile up front, but I'm not seeing a whole heck of a lot. Let me put these back because I definitely moved these so I could clear it out, but I think I'm going to change my mind on that one today. Mm -hmm. I'm picking up enough furniture. I can always come back for it later. They do have plenty of furniture in here too, so if you're looking for something cool, I like that. That's interesting. Bedroom sets. What do we got back in here? Ooh. Vasistas. Look at that in a sec. We got this nice little nut bowl. What is that hand painted Nippon? Three footed bowl, 395. How's the edge feel? Is that damage? Nope, that's not damage. Uh, I just see some paint wear. I don't see any damage. That's beautiful. We're gonna grab that. Cool. What about this bad boy? As is. That's always scary when it says as is. It's a shame because it means there's something. Ooh, this one's super heavy. Wow. Urfilla. It's got a doink spout. That's the as is. It's actually not that bad. Oh, there's a couple doinks on the bottom. It's a pretty picture. What was the price on that? Nine dollars? It's heavy though. This one's actually really heavy. This one wouldn't be too cheap to ship, so I think I'm gonna pay us on that one. We can come back. What else we got? Let's see what we got back in here. I haven't been in this room yet. Hmm. Do do do. Hey, look, it's the original poop emoji. <laughs> Put some sunglasses on it. I should. I should find some sunglasses floating around in here somewhere and put some sunglasses on it. Yes. I thought I was getting yelled at, but no. He just wanted to know if I was definitely sure of my pile so they can start wrapping it because it's getting pretty big. Um, Where was I? Oh, yeah, poop emoji. Get some sunglasses. Let's put some sunglasses on it. I really wish I could find some sunglasses because I would definitely do that. And then, like, have it dressed up as, like, a doctor poop emoji. There we go. Put the stethoscope on it. Now I just need to find the sunglasses to complete the outfit of the vintage poop emoji. <laughs> oh, my God. I don't know what's wrong with me sometimes. I hope you guys are enjoying it. Skylon. Niagara Falls. That's pretty cool. It's a whole whopping dollar. <laughs> poop emoji. It's Dr. Poop. Now it's Dr. Poop. <laughs> and if I find a pair of sunglasses in here somewhere, I am definitely walking back here and putting them on there. God, I hope I find some sunglasses. <laughs> yeah, that's right. <laughs> oh, I can't even, I can't wait till Joss has to edit this video. She's gonna be like, Andrew! What do we got back here? Such a piece of Ellie Smith glass? Hmm. Oh, that's Sterling Overlay. I like that. How much do they want for that? Eight 
Whoa, four dollars. You gotta be kidding me. Oh my god, that's stunning. Oh, that's so nice. Yeah, four bucks we're grabbing that. Bingo. What else we got? <laughs> That's a neat little set. 695, 591. It's a nice little votive set. I like how they're I like the lines on them. Those are really cool. And the base. Hmm. Well, alrighty. I'm gonna go put this up at the front. And I've kind of been through here once already. I've got to get to the other location, get this loaded, get the desk loaded, got to pay for this stuff. I'm going to call it quits here. I don't know how she's going to edit this, but hopefully you guys enjoyed my little adventure here at Finders Keepers, uh, West York. Um, headed over to New Oxford next, and uh, or Cross Keys, and we'll see you over there. Maybe we'll film some stuff over there too. See you later. Bye. I made it. Location two. Finders keepers. Cross keys. See? All by what is it? Myself? Yes. So I got those. I'm gonna go grab the desk. I'm gonna go in and we're gonna shop a little bit and see if we can find anything while we're here. I'm on a little time crunch. I gotta be back by 4:30. It is 2:30. Let's hit it. Time to shop. Let's see if we can see anything while we're here. I got a little bit of time, not a whole lot. So we're not gonna do this too slow. This is not gonna be a typical video where we go like 40 minutes and then go through twice. No, sorry, I can't do that today. I'd love to, but I can't. I like that piece. It's a shame there's no creamer with it, but <laughs> for two bucks, yeah. Oh, I like that. That's check. That's cool. We'll grab that. Let's see, let's see. Hmm. <laughs> Hmm. Steins? Are you an Aquarius? I still need to go back to the other finders keepers and put sunglasses on my poop emoji. The vintage poop emoji. Dr. Poop. <laughs> that was a lot of fun. Mm -hmm. Lots of stuff, lots of stuff. Oh, this is apparently clearance. Oh, that's kind of cool. I didn't know they had clearance. Some books. Mm -hmm. This is the monster desk I have to pick up today. And if Pat doesn't want it, I'm taking it. I think she paid, I think this was like a hundred bucks. No. How much did she pay for this desk? 30 bucks, I think it was. It was either 30 or 26, something like that, but it was stupid cheap. So that's gonna get good use. Let's see, what else do we got in here? Ooh, there's some pretty stuff in this booth. Some really nice stuff in here. I like a little footed nut bowl. Oh, it's marked with caricatures. How much do they want for it? Six bucks as is. What is the as is? Do we see an as is? Yes, I see an as is. It's got that. That's too pretty though. For six bucks? I don't know. Think she's gonna yell at me? It is really pretty. I don't know, I'll come back. I'll think about it. 
I'll think about it. This is cool. What's this? Five with the bird. That's heavy. Whew. Signed, it's Mexican. I like that though. Hmm. I don't know. I don't know. I'm going to pass on that one. This cool reticulated piece. Hand painted by Molly Khan. I don't know. I like it though. I do like that. I really like that. And that one's what? $6.95? Does that say as is? No, it just says hand painted. I really like that. And then it's signed on the back. Yeah. Let's grab that one. We'll grab that to go with. Now I want to see this. This is pretty. Noritake. Oh, look at that. Look at that finial on the top of that lid. Oh, that's amazing. Let's see how the price is. They have another trinket box here too. This one's really nice. That one's marked Japan with the birds. This is a killer trinket dish. Five bucks, yeah. Oh yeah. We're definitely gonna grab this one. Oh, I really like that one. And this one's hand painted too. This one's got birds. I like that for five bucks. Yeah, we'll grab those. Man, this booth has got some beautiful stuff. What's this one? Nippon, hand painted. We've got a lot of plates to get rid of, so I'm gonna hold off on the plate. I think I'll grab, okay, so here's what we're gonna do. We're gonna grab the nut bowl. <laughs> I'm gonna make good use of this reticulated dish. We'll grab the nut bowl, we're gonna grab this bad boy. We're gonna grab this trinket dish. And we're gonna grab this trinket dish. And let's see what else. This is cool earthworks. That's kind of neat. Barbados must be like a souvenir piece or something, but that's really pretty. I like that. I like these little demi toss. These are cool. How much they want for that? Three bucks. CNS. No. Yellow CNS. Cream and sugar? No, that's not a cream and sugar. <laughs> well, let's see what else do we got up further here. I like this. What else? What else? That's a cool piece of art glass. 15. Let's see, maybe I can move the camera up so you can see it. <laughs> I do like that. Oh, hello, little owl. Hmm. Some great stuff in this booth. Told you so. Let's check these dogs out. familiar with that mark. I'll have to look in my Covell's dictionary of pottery and porcelain marks. But I like that because they look like hound dogs. They're pointing. Maybe they're just pointers. But I like that. We'll grab that. That's a cool piece. Let's see what else do we got. So here's my little pile going on. I'm not going to try to carry that up now. We'll wind up breaking something. I want to finish looking in here. Ooh, we got a Hadley piece. The way to a man's heart. Definitely, right through my tummy. <laughs> oh, let's see, okay, so we need to, let's do this. We're gonna grab that. I wanna see these. Are they, are they sterling? They're plate. But that's okay. They're still really nice. 
the ones I've been getting have been uh, sterling lately. But you always check these because sometimes they are sterling, sometimes they're just plate, just like your silverware. But these are definitely plate. They're marked silver plate. So that's easy. What we got here? This is cool. Hmm, made in USA, Ohio. My phone's ringing. Hello? Alright, so I got a little pile going here. Um, I did find another M8 Hadley piece. So we're going to grab this one, this, this covered bowl, and we're going to grab that M8 Hadley piece. And I'm going to put those there. And I'm going to take another peek through here and see if the creepy chalkware soul stealer is going to get me. Look at those eyes. You want to steal your soul? You stay on that shelf. Don't come off that shelf. Let's see what else we got. Some really great stuff in here. I like the shop. I like I like all the finders keepers actually. All the ones I've been into, they've all had really cool stuff. We've done really well with a lot of the stuff we've been able to buy here. Um, I think anybody that comes in here could score a good deal on some things, even if it's just for yourself. Um, he's kind of cool. Kind of folk arty. $7.95. He's probably more modern, but still kind of cool. Oh, let's go back to this booth. There's a lot in here. Hmm. Do, do, do. I like that carnival glass. That's pretty. What else we got? That's interesting. That looks like the lion that's on the Belgian coins. Baldwin Forged Doorstop. $49. If it's an original, it's actually not a bad price. It very well looks like it. <laughs> All kinds of cool stuff in here. And I'm not on a time crunch anymore because apparently I don't have to have the truck back by 4.30 now. So, I'm going to take a little bit of time. I said I wasn't, but now I can. Stangle. I like Stangle. Stangle's got some cool looking stuff. <clears throat> Red Snaggle Tooth. Oh. Hmm, that looks like McCoy. Why does that bottom look like it has? Hmm, that's interesting. How much would they want for that? $13. Hmm. It's a pretty piece. I think it would bring about $15. Let's see what else. Those are nice decanters. Hand painted. Ooh, those are cool. Does this open? Yes, this opens. Can I reach that though? That's the question. Oh, this is going to be interesting. And you guys get to watch me hold the camera and do this at the same time. Now, I'm going to go for those. Let's see. got a doink on the back. I don't know. I think we'll pass on those. This is cool. This is a small piece. She likes this stuff. $3.95. That's a small one. They call that silver crest, I think. Let's see if I'm paying attention. Angry grizzly bear ring. 
I know my filming's not the greatest. I suck. I know it's okay. You can tell me. I can take it till I yell at you. Some pretty art glass. This is nice. This is all hand painted. How much is that? Decanter. Two dollars and forty-eight cents. Yeah. That's really nice. Alright, I need to go put my pile up at the counter before somebody walks off with my stuff, so I will be back. That's sad. Sad lonely puppy. For two dollars we're gonna take him because he's one of those like hound dogs that she's always picking up. I can't remember the name of him. Or he looks like it anyway. For two bucks he's cool. He's so sad he needs to go home with somebody and some other dogs. <laughs> what else we got? I keep gravitating back to this booth. I feel like there's something else in here I need to have, and I don't know what it is. All of you are yelling at me right now. You're telling me something. There's something I need to buy, but I don't know what it is. Well, we do with yep. Nothing else is really like jumping at me going, ooh, you need this. Soulless, creepy eyed, soul stealing, creepy doll. There's all kinds of cool stuff up here. I don't think we've been up this way yet. Do, do, do. Oh. All kinds of stuff up here. There was something. We have a little carnival glass duck that they painted and turned into a little. It's actually kind of cool. Lusterware duck box, seven ninety five, six seventy six. And let me take a quick peek at it. Oh, it's got the. Geez, that's a vintage tag, if I ever saw one. He's cool. Should I get it? Should I get the duck trinket box? I think that would make for a cool, like, um, like nursery gift or something. <laughs> what else? What else? What else? I don't know. Why does that say Ford? Does that say Ford? No, this is Tom. <laughs> These are those Stife Jefferson cups, but this one's been personalized for Tom. Here we got a couple more. Are these Toms? That's TM. Since 1905. Six eleven seventy seven. I don't know. I don't know what all that means. It's too cryptic. Mm -hmm. All right, well, I've been through here at least once, and I'm ready to get this stuff loaded. I haven't had lunch yet. Did I mention I'm doing this all by myself? <laughs> um, I need to grab some food. I'm starting to feel a little wonky. Uh, I need to get back, get all that crap unloaded, get the truck and trailer back, and... Uh, We'll see you guys in a bit. I'll uh, actually, I'll tell you what. I'll take you guys over with me, and I'll show you some of the treasures I picked out, and then we'll wrap it up. Yeah. Oh, I didn't know. Do, 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 do. I can tell just by looking at the at the um the pattern. I guess you call it. This is a really cool bowl. It's covered. I love the the design like and the green. colors. It's got it's got a neat design on the base too. It's like totally deco. Mm -hmm. It's really cool. Get some yellow furniture to throw it on. Some MA Hadley, some trinket boxes. I think we did all right today. A few <laughs> things. Hopefully, I don't get in trouble for any of it. <laughs> 
All right, so this is it. I'm all loaded up. I spent like 60 some bucks here in Cross Keys. I spent a little over 100 at York West. I got my monster desk loaded, you guessed it, all by myself. And uh, we got a couple boxes of stuff going home. So I will see you guys on the next one. I got about a 40 minute drive home, I think. 35, I don't know. I gotta stop and get food. I haven't fooded yet today. So I'm feeling wonky. So I'll see you guys later. Bye. My family calls it my superpower. It's my ability to see value in things that other people might overlook.